What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Crip, and today for today's vlog, we're gonna be trying something a little different for two reasons. One, I just wanted to switch things up, and two, it's Saturday, like 10:30, and I haven't shot a vlog, and I wanted to do one one every week. I know I can give myself a break, but I like I like streaks. I like keeping streaks. Um, it's just fun. Cause once I break the streak, it's it's disastrous. So I'm gonna keep the streak going. And uh today we're doing a top three list. Actually, we're doing a um, three things I learned this week or three things that happened to me this week because uh, they were very significant and I can remember them. So without further ado, number three, I am a content creator. I know, right? Like, duh, Crip, what do you mean you're a content creator? Listen, let me explain. I'm a content creator no matter what I'm doing. Going forward after March 1st, I will be uh, up to me to decide what my financial future looks like and whatever it may be it will be content creating and at the soul of it i'm still going to stream i'm still going to create content that way i'm also going to start diving heavily into more youtube videos because I, it's just a market that every content creator if you're a streamer you're a content creator should be in you should be making youtube videos i'm gonna try to hit that iron hot with tiktok i might uh do a little something different i am spinning up another tiktok for my radiant reflection uh, little thing that I'm doing that I haven't jumped into yet. But uh, I have plans to to get, get busy with the content creation part. And also the mindset coaching that I'm going to be doing, marketing, I'm gonna to need to be creating content on TikTok and Instagram, all that fun stuff. So, hey, guess what? I'm a content creator and this is what it means, blah, blah, blah. You can see what I'm saying, right? So number two, the second thing that I learned this week or that came to fruition is my fellow content creators are also thinking about not abandoning the streaming, but balancing the streaming with the other aspirations they have in this content creation game. Now, there's a group of us. We've been talking about doing this for the longest. We all know it's a necessity. We've seen people grow from it, but we've hesitated from doing it just because it's huge. It's a big leap. It's a huge leap. It's a lot of time commitment and we're so used to streaming. We're so used to that familiar stomping ground. Um, some of us are getting paid from it. Why would we mess that up? But I will tell you this, once you start creating content on other platforms, that's how you get discovered because we all know Twitch is not helping you on that front, but you also start making money in those other platforms, which, you know, that's always good. Making money will help you grow your content a little faster and uh, solidify this as a full-time thing. If that's what you're trying to do, I don't know if that's what you're trying to do. That's what I'm trying to do. It's cool to see that the, my fellow content creators are thinking in that nature. And I'm surrounded by people that have that same mindset. Always good to hang out with people that are trying to rock the way that you rock. So without further ado, let's get to number one. Number one is Elden Ring. Elden Ring. I've been waiting for this game since I heard it was announced. I watched the reveal trailer and I watched that last trailer they just put out. Other than that, I didn't know anything about Elden Ring. I even forgot that the dude from Lord of the Rings was help writing it. Is it that the, is that the same guy? But Elden Ring is amazing. My channel was, uh, I was, I mean, uh, my channel was steadily growing, but when I played Bloodborne, my channel blew the fuck up. And then when I played Sekiro, it kind of got a nice little bump as well. The same thing is happening with uh, with Elden Ring. And I think it's because you can tell that I'm genuinely excited about everything that I find in that game. And uh, I, make it, uh, I make it entertaining. What can I say? Whatever you want, you can catch the clip over on my Twitch page. Uh, thanks, shout out to Jetty. Jedi also, I keep, I keep on the Jedi man. One day he's gonna be like, yo, Crip, stop calling me that. And I'm like, my bad, dude. Uh, <laughs> anyways, yeah, Elden Ring is dope. I can't wait to create some more content with that. I've been recording all my sessions. I'm gonna put together, I don't even know what I'm gonna do with it, but I'm putting together something. By the end of next week, I'm gonna have an Elden Ring video up. That's my promise to me, myself. Maybe I'll cut this part. Yeah, but other than that, it is 1042. Am I gonna be able to cut this before 11 or before 12? That I'll give myself an hour to cut it, get a thumbnail, throw it up. We'll see, you'll be able to tell by, actually I probably won't post it until until the next day 
anyways but it's all about them streaks baby well that's it that's all i got for you if you don't already subscribe to the channel please do so i'm trying to get to a thousand subs because i'm trying to monetize this channel once again so i can start doing great things in this uh entertainment space i guess you can hit the notification bell if you want to so like know immediately oh crib got a new video up i would appreciate that that'd be pretty good and also and also go ahead and comment below what is your favorite game that you're looking for in 2022 or did it already come out because elden ring is out i don't know if you heard the elden ring is out right now and it's really good you probably come watch me play it over on twitch or facebook or youtube i'll play it right here as well you can actually you know what this one as always protect your mental keep creating content and i will talk to you in the next one have a good rest of the week and enjoy the beginning of your next week and then whenever you decide to watch this okay have a good one bye